So this is a petition to be filed by the uh, state government of Penang and Mr. P. Ramakrishnan, former Aliran president, uh, against the respondent, two of them, the Malaysian government and the SPR. Uh, <coughs> this is, of course, with regard to local government elections. Um, so what is this case about? So we just do a summary of what the petitioners are seeking or require, asking the federal court to decide. Uh, under the uh, the court procedure, federal court procedure, we can go straight to the federal court. Uh. We are sidestepping high court and all that. We are going straight to federal court. Uh. So this is a federal court case. So in essence, the petitioner seeks the following relief uh, or declaration. First, number one, a declaration that uh, because of Article 74, 76, and 113 of the Federal Constitution, and of course, and and of course, and uh, also the lease in the ninth schedule to the Federal Constitution, the first petitioner, uh, that is through the State Legislative Assembly, has the sole and exclusive jurisdiction to enact laws in respect of local government elections in the state of Penang. So the first, <coughs> first relief is to ask the court to declare, yes, the Penang state government, uh, state assembly has the jurisdiction to enact law with regard to local government election. Second, to declare that section 10 and section 15 of the Local Government Act 1976 in that these two sections prevent the, the state legislature from providing local government elections within their state is therefore ultra-virus, the power of the federal constitution. And accordingly, what? So we are asking the court to declare that section 10 and 15 are what? Because it is ultra-virus of the uh, federal constitution and because it prohibit the state the legislature from enacting a law about local government election. Uh, the effect of section 15 is state assembly, you've got no right to enact a law. So our argument is it is against the federal constitution because number one, the federal constitution provides the power and jurisdiction to the state assembly. Section 15, as I say just now, uh, section 15, one of the LGA, notwithstanding anything to the contrary contained in any written law, all provisions relating to local government election shall cease to have force or effect. Whatever law previously uh, in place before the LGA came into place yeah, have no more effect. Yeah, no? allows elections. Uh. This override and supersede all other laws with regard to local government election. So this is a powerful section uh, ban elections. that ban local government election. <coughs> so section 10 relates, I think all of you are uh, quite uh, familiar, it relates to the appointment of councillor by the state authority. Since you cannot have local government election, they provide this section for appointment. So we are asking that these two, these two sections actually prohibit the holding of local government election. So, therefore, we have to ask the court to declare that these two sections are ultra-virus and void. So, uh, and also the third, as I say, if uh, alternatively to uh, number one and number two above, uh, the third uh, declaration that by virtue of the say section 15 exemption, actually we have earlier already gazetted the exemption of Section 15 in Penang. I think you still can recall. Uh, we said uh, Section 4 of the LGA gives the state the power to uh, grant exemption of the application of the Act in the state of Penang or any part. So we have already done that. We said 
Section 15 don't apply to Penang. We, we think, so we want to hold election, we say Section 15 don't apply to Penang. And because of there's an already an enactment that we have passed, that is the local government election, bracket, Penang Island and Province Wellesley, enactment 2012. Uh, the second respondent, that is SPR, is validly authorized and required to conduct local government election within the state of Penang. Actually, the court can have uh, uh, can 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 uh, deliberate on number one and number two. Uh. Alternatively, if the court don't want to deal with the two 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 question uh, two declaration, they can deal with uh, what I said just now. We have already exempted section fifteen, and we have the act uh, the enactment in place. So you should go and hold the election. Maybe they were. Uh, I don't know how the court will decide uh, so uh, therefore, and also the lastly, a declaration that the SPR, that is the second respondent, take all immediate steps pursuant to the provision of the LGE, Penang Island and Province Velocity Enactment 2012, to assist in the conduct of the local government election in Penang in accordance with its constitutional obligation. The constitutional obligation of SPR is found in the federal constitution. It says that they are to hold election in the country. No other body but the SPR to hold election. So the, the, the petition will be filed in uh, Putrajaya Federal Court. We are going to Putrajaya. But not because of the election, uh, because of this. <laughs> <laughs> that will come later. Uh, <laughs> because we won. <laughs> this, is, this is Putrajaya because we are going to file a case in the federal court. But still Putrajaya, uh, we are going on Monday to Putrajaya. Well, that's justice. <laughs> so, so, because then the, all the counsellors will automatically... Then you apply to the whole of Malaysia. Because the local government act applies to the whole of Malaysia. Then you got to ask the uh, Perak Menteri Besar, Menteri Sengguan Menteri Besar, or the new Menteri Besar. <laughs> Since I think this will not be decided before the, elect the general election. So that would, the impact is the whole, whole country, uh, not only in a... Of course this refers to a petition with regard to an enactment in, in, <coughs> in Penang. If the court so decide, I think, then, uh, if uh, Section 15 is declared declare void, then I think the whole country can have a uh, local government election. That is tantamount to saying all the states, except for Sabah and Sarawak, uh, which doesn't, which the LGA doesn't cover, I think. Uh, sorry, Section 